what is it that you really want? Because there's something I know about each and every one of you. There's something that you want. There's a secret inner want. And every once in a while, that secret inner want pops into your conscious mind. And we have a tendency to push that away and say, I can't have that or I can't do that. I was diagnosed with skin cancer. And my world was flipped upside down. I'll walk 18 holes of golf. I'll put 60 pounds on my back hiking in the Adirondacks for three days. But I remember after four days of going to the gym, I remember in my bathroom at my house and I looked in the mirror and I said, man, I don't look any different after four days of going. Well, how come Realtor is in the room, you get this lead and after four days, they didn't email me back and buy a house. So what do we do? We give up on them. If you're only dealing with the people that are in front of you right there, you're losing so much business that's coming off the table. And I just felt totally defeated. I felt like I have been through so much. We can change your paradigm, everything else will change. Now, not only do people have old paradigms, entire industries have old paradigms. And I'm gonna to suggest to you that here in real estate, the whole industry, we operate in a pretty old paradigm. You have the business you earn. So if you're unhappy with the business you have, then you need to do something different. So I decided to stand up for my health. An important principle of success in all walks of life is a willingness to go the extra mile. The difference between feeling blessed and feeling stressed is your attitude. It's your attitude that determines how you feel at any given time. Success doesn't bring happiness. Happiness brings success. Laughter is the best medicine. Laughter actually increases your immunity. So it actually helps you heal. What do you think it is that most people on their deathbeds regret? It's not what they did in their lives, it's what they didn't do. It's about the people. Always about the people. Craig said it well today, he said the people that are right in front of you are the most important, but you cannot neglect the people that are on the fringe. We need people, we are human beings and we need people. We need to feel connected. Whether we're with the same company or an outside company that we're cooperating with, there is a true sense of togetherness. It's what makes our industry so great. We all want to know that we can give back to something that's bigger than ourselves, that we belong to something that is greater. Thankfully, my doctors were able to treat my cancer. I had a new start to life, so I hope that you will appreciate the gift of life and all that comes with it including the relationships that add meaning to our lives. I hope that you will be inspired to believe that all things are possible, to believe that better days are ahead, to value your relationships over accomplishments. I do absolutely believe that together we can do anything. Together we're an office. Together in this room we're a region. Together we're a community. And together, especially in this market now, we are definitely going to succeed.